the study presents monthly global land evapotranspiration ET, synthesis products based on satellite and or in situ observations or land surface models driven with observations-based forcing or output from atmospheric reanalyses. The merged synthesis products over the shorter period are based on 40 distinct data sets while those over the longer period are based on 14 data sets. The study provides statistics for four merged synthesis products and shows that multiannual variations of ET in the merged synthesis products display realistic responses, consistent with previous findings of a global increase in ET between 1989 and 1997 followed by a significant decrease in this trend. The global mean ET from the merged synthesis products is estimated to be 493 mm year minus 1, 1.35 mm d minus 1, for both the 1989 to 1995 and 1989 to 2005 products, which is relatively low compared to previously published estimates. The study also estimates global runoff to be 263 mm year minus 1, 34 406 cubic kilometers year minus 1, for a total land area of 130,922,000 square kilometers. To reduce uncertainties in current ET products, Improving the accuracy of input variables and parameterizations of ET is crucial. This article was authored by B. Mueller, M. Hershey, C. Jimenez, and others. We are article.tv, links in the description below.